only. Do we have any Muslim? Anyone? Anybody? Yeah, because we have a reason to say only Muslims, because you people, you want to hear a debate with Muslim, right? We don't want to hear that, but this, this is what the Muslim do. The Muslim, they bring a Muslim, and both of them, they start bashing Islam, uh, Christianity, right? We don't want to do that. Okay, we have Mr. Bilal. How are you, Bilal? How are you doing, Christian Prince? I'm fine, my What's going friend. on? How are you? Good, good, not bad. So, Bilal, you are a Muslim, right? You know who I am, Christian Prince? No, not really. I do not know. We spoke two times, uh, I think, uh, two months ago. Oh, okay. Sorry, I don't remember. Okay. Yes, yes. Go ahead. Yes, I am Muslim, though. Yes, alhamdulillah. You speak and Arabic, I want to say, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh to my brothers and sisters who are uh, watching. Hmm. Uh, go ahead. So Go ahead, Christian Prince. So you said assalamu alaikum to the Muslims only, right? Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Yes. To the Muslims. Okay, what do you say to the Christians? May Allah curse you. What do you say to them? Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. To the Christian too? Yes, to the Christians too. But I thought you cannot say that. Well, I just did. So uh, are you a good Muslim or you are disobeying your prophet when you do that? Wallahi, uh, we, we as human beings, we have ups and downs in life. So okay. I will never let to Zaki and Fusukum. I will never uh, praise myself. This is another question, my friend. I'm asking you. As I know, your prophet... Yeah, I'm tell and I'm telling you, am okay. I a good Muslim or not? I'm telling you, I have ups and downs. No, no, I'm I, not going to say I'm, yes. Okay, Bilal. I'm talking about certain things. You said, Assalamu alaikum to the Christian, which means peace to you, Christians, correct? Yes, to okay. my true Christian. I say... To the true Christians, okay, not, the, okay, who, not the fake ones. Not the fake ones. Okay, who is the, the true pro Christians who? are the ones that believe in one God. Oh, okay, but okay, I will go yes. with you now. So, guys, if you are a true Muslim, a true Christian who believe in one God, all of us we believe in one God. All Christian believe in one no, God. No, you, you don't. You don't believe. You believe God had a son. Oh, okay. So, if you are a Christian who believe God have a son, what do you say to them? Curse you or what? No, not curse you. Allah uh, May Allah guide you guys. Okay, but isn't the, okay? But isn't it the Quran says Allah guide not who He deceived? Allah guide who? Allah guide not who he deceived. Allah guide not who he deceived? Yes. Uh, you, you're asking me questions, just please like make a topic and then make a point. No, this is my, this is our topic, we are continuing. Is it the Quran says, Allah he guide not those who they, he deceived? Yes, the, 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 the ones who are uh, who are deceivers. No, no. It does not guide them. It doesn't say that. It says those who he deceived. He deceived. Who, who, who Allah deceived? Yes. Okay, I'm uh, okay. Okay, I mean, I don't know. Do you know what I'm talking I, about? I don't or, know. You are, uh, or you are just saying, okay, without I, I, no, no, I, 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 would, I would uh, enlighten me, enlighten me, enlighten okay. me. So, have you ever heard that Allah said in the Quran, <laughs> Allah guide not who He deceived? Yeah, yes. Okay. Can you say it in Arabic? Maybe in Arabic it sounds more. Uh, okay. Can you say it in Arabic? And Yes. Where okay. Allah uh, uh, whoever Allah. Uh, What's the opposite of guide? Not guide. Okay. So, guide, yeah. and he, he will not guide them. Okay, guys. So Allah is so, the one who guides. So, so yeah, yes, friend, Allah is the one who guides people, and he and he uh, misguides people. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. So, guys, we heard our friend Bilal here confirming that Allah is the devil, 
he is the one who misguide people. Yes. Uh, Yes, but, he, but, he, uh, but, he, how, but how does he guide and how does he misguide? That's the question. How he misguide? Tell me. How he misguide? Through action. Me. Through action. Amal on Salah. No, but he well, said. Amal on okay, so Allah, he, okay, so Allah, he misguide yeah. us by making us do bad things, correct? No, 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 no. How he he doesn't us? misguide us by making us. How? You do bad things and you get misguided. You no, do good things, no, 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 you no, get no, guided. No, no, no. You see the Quran saying, are you going to guide the one who Allah misguide? So, yes. okay, so what the verse is saying clearly Listen, that you cannot guide someone. What did that someone, person do? You cannot guide what did someone, that person do in his life? Whatever he do, it was Allah who misguided him to do that. Yeah. What does Allah say? The, the verse is so clear. What does Allah say to Adam when he sends them down to earth? What does Allah say to Adam when he sends them down to earth? What does Allah say to Adam when he sends them down to earth? What Allah said to him, tell me. What are you... You know the ayat, Surah Al-Baqarah, I'm driving, I can't bring it up, but go to Surah Al-Baqarah, uh -huh. go to the ayah where he sends him down to earth, okay. and read it in Arabic, and let's translate it. Okay. What does he say to him? Okay, let me ask you first, I will go there. Did Allah, go ahead, go did, there. Uh, did Allah deceive Adam, and Adam was a victim of Allah, or Adam, he commits sin? Adam, Adam commit, uh, disobeyed Allah's command. What is the proof that he disobeyed Allah's command? He uh, ate from the the tree. Okay, but isn't it your prophet? He says that Allah he planned for Adam to eat from the tree forty years before he created him. Yes, I, we know that Allah knows the, uh, the knows the future. No, this is not about. We knowing, know that Allah knows This is not about knowing the future. There's a, there, there's it a is hadith. About the future. There's a hadith. It is no, about no, no, my friend. It's about this. No, thing. no. It's go about, to, but please go to that uh, verse in the Quran, please, before you uh, go go to another uh, okay, what, hadith. What verse you want me to go to? There's many verses. Your prophet. It's in the it's in the beginning of the story in Surah Al Baqarah, yeah. chapter two, okay. where uh, he sends um, Adam down to earth, and then okay. what does he say to him after? I would like to for you to just translate that to the people. Okay, we we we'll go there and we will laugh together. Here we go. In chapter two, chapter two, verse number thirty-six, it says, "And Satan." He made them slip from the garden. Hmm? Mm -hmm. And then Allah, he said yep. to them, get down. Correct? Exactly. Yes. Okay. Get down from and where? Get down from where? Hold on a second. Let's pass out the point here. What's, what's next? Keep going. Okay. And then, and uh, we will make... Uh, read it all, please. We, we will, make, the, all. We will yep. make your enemy to each other. So you're not going to read the part where it says... And if, if uh, guidance comes from me, okay. whoever follows the guidance, well, okay, can no, you read that part? It doesn't, it doesn't say that, my friend. It says, it says, and uh, then he learned Adam, he learned Adam from his Lord, words of inspiration, and his Lord turned yeah. toward him for he of returning most merciful. So uh, the translation is funny. It says here that uh, Adam, he repent, you know, or he received words from Allah. And then Adam, he repented, yes. and Allah, he accepted his repent. Is that what you're yes. talking about? No, not that. After that. Okay. Then we said to them, he, all of you, okay, them, I'm, just, he, I'm just reading a sentence after yeah. sentence. Then Allah, he says, yes, sorry, get, get down, get down yeah. all of you of this place. Okay. And yeah. and whenever guidance, okay, when uh, guidance from me, and whoever yes. follow my guidance, yes. there shall be no fear yes. on them, and shall no, they grieve. Okay. So do you accept yes. this verse? Well, there we go. So this is the verse I'm talking about. Okay. So this is the, for every man that has ever been created from Adam till now. All right. Every man, uh -huh. he follows this law. This law, okay. when God send, uh, gives you guidance, mm -hmm. or uh, sorry, when, when you do good things mm -hmm. that God has guided to, uh, to do, uh, to, uh, to, to you to do, and you do them, God will continue to guide you. Okay. God will continue to guide you until you get to paradise. All right. But if you do the opposite, mm -hmm. where the where, where Satan or the Shaitan or whatever you want to call him, mm -hmm. when you do the opposite, you go down a, the wrong path. Okay. And this is something that the Christians cannot disagree with because uh, the Christians also have, uh, you know, Satan in their in their uh, book as well, who he tries to misguide the people. Mm -hmm. am, I, am so, I wrong on that? Or? Okay, you are done. 
Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. All right. Ahead. But but if we if we go to two verses, you choose for me the verses where I showed you chapter four, verse number eighty-eight, where it says, "Are you going to guide the one who Allah is guide?" And you agree with it. It says that. And then you showed me the verse in chapter two, verse number thirty-eight, where it says, "When guidance, my guidance come to you." But in the other verse says, "Are you going to guide the one who I am is guide?" So guidance of Allah will not come to the one who Allah is guide. And every single human being is misguided by Allah, starting from Adam. Do you agree that's with right. me? That's right. That's right. That's okay. right. That, that's right. No one gets. Uh, that no man can guide another man. You have to understand that no man can guide another man without God's uh, intervention in it. No, this so is, God this is, is the one who guides and he misguides. This is not what the verse is. No, this saying. is. He's speaking. To, no, no. There, there's saying, another verse where he's speaking to Prophet Muhammad prophet, directly. Okay, and he tells him. Okay, he's saying to Muhammad. He tells him, you can, Are you going to guide the one who I am his guide? Which means he's doing it wrong when he tried to guide the one Allah is guide, correct? Who's doing wrong? Muhammad okay. is doing wrong? Yes, Allah is saying to him, Are you going to guide the one who I am his guide? Correct? Yes. Okay. okay. That's mean. That's mean. It is not right to guide the one I did lie to him and I deceived him because how Allah he misguide people by making them believe in wrong belief. Sorry, how does he misguide people? Sorry, I didn't get that. Yes, how, how Allah he how Allah he misguide people by making them what? What when I say misguided, I'm talking about belief. I'm not about a look. If a person he is uh, uh, he don't keep uh, nice. Please, please, please. Okay. If you're gonna say the story, say say the full story, please. I, I'm the, story, the full story. Uh, is the very first, clear. Is, okay, let us go and see the whole story. So, Thank you very much. This is, no, no, the full this story is, is very clear. This the full is, story. This let is me your speak. prophet. This is your the, the prophet. Satan, uh, Bilal, Bilal. Satan disobeyed God. No. Or the Shaitan or no. Iblis, whatever you want to call him. First, first disobeyed God. First, Satan. God sent him and Adam down to earth. Okay. Hold Satan on. said, "I'm gonna misguide all your guy. I'm gonna misguide your creation." Okay, let me ask you. Is Shaitan, God said, "Okay." Is Shaitan is against what? Allah or he work for Allah? He's against Allah. Can you show me a proof? He's against. What do you mean? Show you proof? I just told you what he said in the Quran, where he says, "I'm gonna misguide everyone. I'm gonna. Well, he's gonna attempt to misguide everyone, and then God says, you cannot misguide.' No. Uh, you see, what, uh, Shaitan, I, uh, Shaitan he is an employee of Allah. Chapter six, verse one twelve. It says, "And we have appointed for every prophet enemies, shayateen." All of us are employees to God. All of us are, are servants to God. That's another question. So Shaitan is employee of Allah and he is doing the work for Allah to be the enemy of the Prophet. Correct or not? That's not what Allah says in the Quran, though. Huh? That's not what Allah says in the Quran. That's not what he says in the Quran. I, I, I don't understand. Say again. That's not what he says in the Quran. In the Quran, he, he tells uh, uh, the Shaitan to bow down to Adam. He doesn't bow down. Hmm. And then he, he is. Uh, I, I, like kicked out of uh, kicked out of uh, wherever he was, and and it sent down to earth, and he first became the all, enemy. First of all, very clear. first of all, the, the, the point, Shikis, first Shikis. of all, the verse you are talking about have nothing to do. Allah is ordering shaitan. Nowhere in the verse it says Allah he ordered shaitan. Allah he ordered the angels to bow down to Adam. He did not say shaitan bow down. Which is a, which is showing the mistake in the Quran and contradiction and you know silly mistake, because when Allah He order He order only the angels to bow down to Adam. The same chapter you quote for me is a chapter two verse number thirty four. And remember when we said to the angels, protest yourself before Adam, and they protested. Except Shaitan, but Allah did not order the Shaitan to bow down. He ordered the angels, and according to Islam, right, Shaitan, this, this Shaitan goes, is not an, Shaitan is not an angel. Hold your, on, hold on, hold on. So this, this is so this is a mistake, and this is silly mistake of the author of the. No, Quran. no, no. This goes back to your ignorance of the Arabic language okay. and, and my ignorance of the Arabic language. Okay. Obviously, you're you're not an Arabic scholar. Uh -huh. uh, but here we have uh, many. Uh, like a thousand, let's say a thousand angels and one and one iblis in the hmm. in the congregation. He okay. tells them all to bow down. Okay, and and uh, they all bow down. All the angels, nine hundred and ninety nine, bow down. Let's just say. Okay. And iblis doesn't bow down. Okay. It's, I don't know the Arabic, and you don't know CP one hundred percent. I know you don't know the Arabic uh, language that well. 
to actually understand this because in the other ayah he talks about the shaitan being a jinn at least being a jinn hmm. correct or not hmm. are you done tell him in a jinn are you done are, was he was he from the jinn or not are you done yes he is are you done yeah he's from Okay, so the excuse of not knowing Arabic, this is very silly because I'm showing you the Islamic translation and all of them, they don't say that Shaitan, he was one of them. The, 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 the Quran is so clear in Arabic and in English, it says, We said to the angels, we said to the angels bow down. So if Allah, he says, all of you bow down, whoever there is going to bow down, he did not say that. He said, I said to the angels, so Allah, he chose exactly the kind of the one who will bow down because it was the angels who accused Adam he would do mischiefment and it was not Iblis one of them so what your answer is is very silly and have nothing to do with the Quran you are making your own excuse to cover up the stupidity of the verse because the one okay who is the one accused Adam would do mischiefment is it shaitan or the angels uh, sorry, CB, can you read the other ayah, please? Uh, no, 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 about the other I, I want you to answer me. Who, is the, one, who is the one who accused Adam to do mischiefment, Shaitan or the angels? The, the angels were. The angels. Okay, so the, the normal thing is to punish the angels, not the one who did nothing wrong. So the angels is the one who accused Adam. Allah get upset from them because well, no, they that, said that. That has nothing to do with the sajda. Huh? That has nothing to do with the sajda. Uh, it has nothing to do no, with the Jews. No, it have to do it. Read, read the verse. No, read the verse before it. No, read the verse before it. He said to them, let me teach. Okay, listen, listen, listen. When they said, when we, when they said that Adam would do mischiefment, Allah, he taught Adam all the names. Hold on. Allah, he taught Adam all the names to prove to them that they are a bunch of liars. The Quran confirmed that angels of Allah are a bunch of liars. They are not, not a bunch of liars. They don't prove. No, not a bunch okay. of liars. Did Allah? Did Allah say to the angel? Did, did Where Allah... do you get lying from? Can you show me the word? Hey, Where do you get lying from? A, it's, it's they, a, they accused Adam. It's in the front of me. It says. Okay, it's in the front of no, me. No, it says. It Adam. says. Hold on. It says. In kuntum sadiqin. Translate to the audience, please. Vila, do you speak Arabic? <laughs> when Allah He said, "In kuntum sadiqin," translate for me. What in kuntum sadiqin mean? If you are truthful, truthful. Thank you. That's mean they are truthful. But then what does he do after? What he do? He punished what them. Does he do after? He punished them. He examined no, them. No. He examined them. He, he, he taught Adam the names and he said to them, tell me the names, tell me the names of those things. If you are truthful, which means if you cannot tell me the names, you are not truthful. <laughs> okay. Then what did he say? He said, if... You see, I told you, I know what you do not know. No, this is not the, I know. This is not the question. Did Allah, he said to them, tell me the names of those things if, they, if you are truthful? Yes. He did not say if you are a person who knows. He said if you are truthful. In Kuntum Sadiqeen. And the Muslim, they claim that Allah speak perfect Arabic. And Allah, he used the word clearly saying, if you are not lying, which means if you are truthful, which means if you are truthful, tell me the name of those things. If you fail to tell me the names of those things, you are not truthful. Well, what did he say after? He, he told them, I, okay, so what? He, so I know what you do not know. So I have to do, do something with no. Okay, uh, so so when, when the angels, they claim to know, oh, that's mean they are lying. Did they claim that they know? Did they claim that they know? Yeah. They, yes, they accused. They didn't claim that they know. They accused. No, they accused. That means it's a false excuse. Okay, it's a, it's a false ac ac accusation or a true accusation? It's a false accusation or a true accusation? Yeah. It is what it is, what the people this did after that. This is question. Hey guys, look at the answer. It is what it is because he's afraid not to answer. Oh, it, is it a false accusation no, against Adam or it is not? Against Adam himself? No, it wasn't uh, a false accusation. It was not. So Allah is a liar then. Because Allah said to them, no. tell me the name of those things if you are truthful about what you said about Adam would do achievement.
<laughs> okay, what's the what's the Christian perspective in that? This in that is not scenario? Don't change the topic. Don't change the topic. So no, no, not change the topic. It's the same topic. I would, just love, to know, I would love, love to know the Christian perspective. Please. Later we can finish this and we can go to the Christian. Now you are trying, I'm not with you. I'm with you. I'm trying to I'm escape. With you, the you are trying to escape. I'm not trying to escape. I'm not trying to escape. I'm not trying to escape. You are trying. I told you. You are okay. Then don't change. We can go there after we finish this one. I'm not changing. I'm telling you, you're Arabic. I'm you. And my Arabic. As long as everybody heard you saying. That the, 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 the accusation, the accusation against Adam was right, truthful. Right. They were right. You said that. You said the accusation the angels made against Adam was truthful. So when Allah He said to them, "Tell me the names of those things if you are truthful," that means Allah Himself was not the truthful one because they are the truthful, and you admit that. And Allah is against them for saying something not a truthful, challenging them. If you are truthful, to tell me the names of those things, and because now they could not tell him the names of things, He said to them, "I know what you know not," which means you are wrong and you are untruthful. So now I'm asking you, the accusation against, against Adam, when you said it is a truthful, did Allah make a stupid mistake by saying that Adam is not going to do what the angels said? No, it's not a stupid mistake because we do not understand this whole universe. We do not understand how things work. What does have to do with we my do question? Do not understand how things work. Why, why we switch? Why we switch well, now to answer, talk about it? Why we switch about not, talking not about universe work. now? I'm asking you a specific question about a guy. His name is Adam. I'm, how I'm, this had to do yes, with the universe? Adam. Listen, I'm I told you, you. I, I Adam, told you my Adam, about Adam, he was accused to do mischievement. Allah, he said, get, "Tell me the names of those things if you are truthful." Which mean, Allah, he said, if you cannot tell those names. You are not a truthful, do you agree? If you cannot tell me the names, you are not truthful? Yes. No, he did not say you are not truthful. Man. Well, read the verse then. Here we go, guys. I, I don't know what's wrong with those said, I know what you do not know. That's no, all no, 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 no. Read carefully. Verse number 31, it says, and let me yes? read for you. And he taught uh, Adam all the names of everything, and then he showed them to the angels, and he said, Tell me the names of those things if you are truthful. So if they are truthful, they will be able to tell the names of those things, correct? If you are truthful, yes. Okay, but, that, uh, okay but they were not able to tell the names, so they are truthful. Okay, so... What do you mean, okay? So, A second ago you said they are yeah, truthful. Yeah, yeah. No, no, I'm, I'm, I'm with you. I'm with you, CP. I'm with you, CP. Okay. I'm telling you, I'm telling you that... They uh, they say they they said something. Hmm. Then Allah taught Adam something, and then Allah sh uh, showed it to the angels. Hmm. The angels didn't know what it was, hmm. and then Allah tells them, "I know what you do not know." Hmm. And then you ask me, and I'm going to be honest. You ask me, uh, uh, were the angels right? Mm -hmm. Do we have killing on earth? We do have killing on earth. Okay. Do we have people that mischief? We do have people mischief. All right. On earth. That's correct, 100%. Okay. Now, do I know what that means? No, I don't. What? So that's, so that's my answer to that. Now, answer? I'm asking you. No, no, where's the answer? Hold on, hold on. Your Christian the perspective. What is the answer? The angels, they say to Allah, What's your that answer Adam, to that? are you going to create someone with doom achievement? Allah, he said to them, Tell me the names of those things if you are truthful. Truthful about what? About he would do mischievement. And you just said, Adam, he did killing. His children did killing. They did mischievement. So when Allah, he challenged the angels, right. when Allah, he challenged the angels, saying to them, if you are truthful, truthful about an accusation they made against Adam. So you just admitted yes. that the angels, they were right and Allah was wrong. What kind of God he have such a logic? Secondly, if I told you, he was not wrong. He didn't say they're not going to do that. Secondly, secondly, the God said they're not going to do that. Bilal, Hold on a second. Let us say, let us say, be, the God said he's not going to do that. Bilal, Bilal, listen, this? Listen, 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 God listen, said listen. they're not going to do that. Bilal, 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 let me That's what you have to understand. Let me ask you a, 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 a simple question. Don't try to twist it. Okay, do you think. Allah but, didn't say they're not going to do that. What do you mean? Correct or not? Allah, he said, Allah said they're not he said if you are a truthful, that means you are lying. No, no, no. Did God say they're gonna? They are gonna mischief. 
Oh, they're not going to achieve. Did he say that? Yes, he said that because if they are truthful, this will happen. If they are not truthful, that will not happen. So what is, what is the angel that said? The angel did not say that Adam will eat cheese kebab. The, the angel did not say he will eat hummus. The angel they said he will do mischief. So he said to them, tell me the names of those things if you are truthful. So the only argument is about what? About Adam will do mischief. So if you are truthful, tell me. If you pass the exam, that's mean you know the unknown. That's mean you know the truth. That's mean you know that Adam will do mischief. Man. I know what you know not. Mean he will not do that. And I am telling you that because I know the names of those things. You do not know the names of those things. So Allah, he proved to the angel that he knew the unseen by giving things names, which is very silly. If you, if you have a dog with you or a cat and you name your cat Susu and you say to me, Christian Prince, what is the name of my cat? I say to you, I do not know. Is that proving that you are God? That is the most stupid excuse ever. Because if Allah is the one who named the things and then he asked them what the name of those things and they could not, that will not prove that Allah knows the unseen. It should be the opposite. Allah should say, okay, go behind the wall and give names for those things and don't tell me. And come here and ask me the names and then I will tell you the names. But what he did is the opposite, showing us that the one who came with the story is a kid. Because you naming something and then asking someone else what is the name, that will not prove that you know the unseen. Because it is seen by you. You are the one who gave them the names. So it's a very stupid story coming from a very silly book and there is no excuse for such a thing. Same time, you are the one who said that the angels they were truthful and Adam did mischievement. And when Adam he did mischievement, it was Allah's decision for Adam to do mischievement or it was against the will of Allah. All right. So, so um, where did the angels get that information from? I don't know. You tell me. Maybe from Facebook. From Facebook? You tell me. How, how come the angels, they know more than your God? I'm not, uh how I'm asking angels, you, I'm asking you, where did, where did they get that information? Me, don't from? ask me, this is your story, this what? is your God, ask your what? God, my friend. Why? You're the, the one, one, you're the one that knows, right? No, you're I the am, one that knows, I am right? the one is laughing at the story, and you need to tell me where the angels, they got their information from, because this is the question that is proved to us that the Quran is not a book to explain anything. It's a silly book, there's no answers. If I ask you the same question, so who, who, okay, who, uh, okay, who was on earth before man? Let say, who was on let, earth before let man? Us say, let us say, for the sake okay, of... Anyway, Hold on. Okay. I will go. I will use your question here. Allah, how the angels they knew? I'm waiting okay, for good. the answer. Yes, Allah. Inshallah, you get it in your dream. What? Um, TP, what? do you, do you, do you, uh, inshallah, you get it in your dream. I said, you ask Allah, inshallah, you get it in your dream. Ah, I so I am going to have no. it in the dream. It is not in inshallah, the dream. I, I, so you can't answer I said, me. inshallah, so anybody that knows so Arabic, inshallah means God willing. First God of willing. all, inshallah is not an Islamic word. It is a Jewish okay. man who taught you a prophet. Okay, it's a, Jew, it's, a Jew, it's a Jewish word. And we're going to use it, inshallah. No, no, we're going to use it. Exactly. We're, no, we're going to use it. The, the, the Jew, I, can I use no, a Jewish word or no? no I'm not allowed? No, you cannot. You can use Allah, but you cannot use. You cannot it's use haram? God is willing because your God, your prophet was. It's, it's haram to use the uh, uh, Jewish word. You are a prophet, haram? yes, because the prophet. Haram? Yes, haram because your prophet says khalifuhum, which means don't say what they say, <laughs> no. don't do what they do. No. Is it? This is your. No, no. This, is your this is your no. prophet. This is your prophet. Your prophet. He's so. I'm speaking English he, he now, so I shouldn't be speaking English. You're a prophet. So I shouldn't be speaking English. Hold on. You're a prophet. He was a pro uh, you're a prophet. He was a praying. A Jewish walked by, and, and, okay, and the Jewish man okay. he said to him, "This is how we do it." You're a prophet. He said, "Sit down. Sit question. down." Act differently. I want to ask so the question actually for to sure. act like them, to sure. say like them. Secondly, the word inshallah, which means God is willing, as most of them mean, it means that you believe in a God who have a will. Do you have the you do you believe in the will of God? Okay, uh, fair enough to be I don't want to jump into that. Can I ask you a question? I have a question uh about something. Mm -hmm. Can I ask you? Go ahead. You want to change the topic, right? No, no, no. I, because we, we did not finish about Adam. According to your prophet, Adam, he commits sin. Adam, he commits sin because Allah, he forced him to do that. And this is the height in front of you. It is in Sahih al-Bukhari. So my question, my question is, do, do Christians uh, eat, uh, like, uh, you know, in, in Muslims, we, uh, there's halal meat. Hmm. 
and and in, in Judaism they have kosher. Hmm. Do Christians have anything like that, TP? What do you mean? Like kosher meat okay. or halal meat? First of all, yes, we have something is called kosher meat, but Muslims all the food the Christian they eat is halal for them. Correct or no? All the food that Christians eat? Yes. All the food that Ahl al-Kitab eat, so yes. Christians and Jews, yes. Well, your God, he called us people of the book, which means we are the one of a book and you don't have one. So no, not, not you, CP, not you who believes in a son of God, not you, uh, CP. Uh, well, your Quran, not you. your Quran, the real Christian. Your Quran called the, real Christian. the people, hold on, just to show everybody not how... Not like you. Okay, so not you are saying, like you. okay, hold on, so are you saying that when Allah, he says the people of the book, yeah. he means those who don't believe that Jesus is son of God? No, no, I'm telling you what, uh, what uh, Ahl al-Kitab. Okay, Ahl -Kitab. Well, okay I'm, I'm, let me repeat the question. You are not listening. You are not listening. Relax, relax, relax. relax. No, no, let me repeat the no, question no. slowly. Hold on. Are you saying, are you saying, are you saying, hold on. Are you saying, listen carefully. Are you saying that when the Quran says people of the book, he mean only those who don't believe that Jesus is son of God? I am saying the true one mm -hmm. that had the original. This is not the Bible. question. This is not the question. When you go, listen, listen carefully. Okay. Listen I'm carefully. I'm listen listen you. carefully. When you God, yeah. He called a group of people, the people of the book. Do He mean everybody who believe in Jesus as Son of God, or only those who don't believe in Jesus to be Son of God? Allah says in the Quran, uh, He names the. Uh, 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 why you don't give me the answer? Give me the answer and tell me what Allah said in the Quran. I'm asking I give you, you. I give you my answer. I give, I give you the answer, answer first. Like... Give me the answer. When Allah He says, "People of the book," do He mean the ones who believe in Jesus to be the Son of God, or those who don't believe in Jesus to be the Son of God? Which one? Uh, Allah mentions them in two different ways, so I do not know. This, uh, a second ago, you know, a second ago you say he don't mean the Christians. A second ago, a second ago, a second ago you say he a, 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 second, a second ago you say Oh, a second ago, yeah. I said to you, no, no, I'm telling you, what does it mean, Ahl al-Kitab? What being, does it mean, Ahl al-Kitab? My friend, you are being hypocrite, and you are... Uh, no, you're being... A, you are, no, you are, you're trying to you are, me, you're trying you to court me, but you know what, you are biting me. your tongue, you are biting because your tongue. Did you say... I'm biting my tongue or what? Did you say, did you say that you, it, when, you, when the Quran said... Did you say, give me the original Bible that was given to Jesus, please? Did you give me the original Gospel? Let us repeat it again. Did you say... Did you give me the original Gospel? When the Quran say that... People the book, he don't mean those who worship Jesus the Son of God. King James Version. Everybody heard Trump you. Version. Everybody heard you. Love Version. This is translation. Yes, version. This is translation. Uh, Mark Version. This is translation. This is translation. You are being, you are being silly now. Yusuf Ali Version. version. Yusuf Ali Version. Uh, 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 where did King James come from? Is King James a prophet? Muhammad Khan Persian. The Woody Persian. Community Persian. Arbery Persian. Version, not Version. Version. Version, not Version. Sorry, Version. So all of those are there's our translation, so you are a fool again, and you are changing the topic to escape. So I'm asking you again. How many when versions? You said, we have one version of the Quran. You, when, you said, the Quran. when you said, no, you don't have one version of the Quran. Even your prophet, he make it the clear. Version. Okay, you don't have one version oh. of the Quran. Hold on. Uh, we can, we can go there. Don't version. change the topic. Don't change the topic. We will go there. Everybody will laugh at you in a, in a second. In a second. Even, even, even Aisha, she said that Omar al Khattab, he said that the Quran was a 1,025,000 letter. And now we don't have even 270 letters of it. So more, more than 90% of the Quran is gone. Don't go there now. We will go there later. Now, I'm asking you. When you oh. said, when oh. you said, when you said that the people of the book, when the Quran speak about the people of the book, that means yeah. those who don't believe that Jesus is Son of God. Are you biting your tongue yeah. back for what you said, or you are going to admit that you were wrong? Hello? I'm listening. I'm waiting for you. Do you admit that you did you did not tell the truth when you said when the Quran used the word the word of God or sorry the book of God the, the, the people of the book 
He meant those who believe. You, you said that. He meant those who believe that Jesus is not Son of God. Are you sure from what you just said or you made a poo-poo? No, Allah says in the Quran, He, he calls the, 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 the Christian, the, he, he says uh, the Christian uh, who, who say that Jesus is the son of God. He names it. He says that in the Quran. This is not the that question. Is this is not the question. Bilal, you are in trouble. So, no, no, you not did, in trouble. But did, now we have to understand you did, you did, what does it mean? You did dig uh, a hole. Did you did dig a hole. What did I say? Uh, did you, did you did no, no, I didn't dig a hole. I'm, I'm telling you, okay. what was the initial topic? Um, the initial uh, topic okay. so was what? So give me the answer. Uh, do you guys have, do you guys you have said, a halal or kosher? Who said you have kosher? I'm you. I didn't. You gave me the answer. I don't see in one supermarket in Canada and America where they have kosher. Only the Jews only the Jews eat the kosher. Don't go to Walmart. Don't go to Walmart yet. Don't go to Walmart. Walmart, you are running away. I'm asking you. You well, said. Where are you said. You said. Where everybody heard you. Show me one Christian who eats kosher. You Please. Oh, oh, Show so me listen, one Christian. Listen. Listen. You it's said. You eat kosher. You said. You said. You eat kosher. Listen, Ibn Farouk. Listen. I'm asking you. Listen, listen, when you say to me that yeah. when, when the Quran, kosher? when the Quran, it's a, do you eat kosher? Quran, I'm asking you, you said, do you eat kosher? You said when the do Quran, you eat kosher? The answer listen, is 100% no, you don't eat when kosher. When you say to me, no. the Quran, when the Quran, and there's every the Christian, the book, the Quran, I was raised in the West, not like you, you unlike you, I was raised in the West, and I understand how, people how, how the Christians are. I want a clear there's answer what? to repeat what you just said. No Christians eat kosher, bro. No Christians. It's only Jews eat kosher, Okay, guys, did you hear what he said? Did you hear what he said? Did you hear what he said? He said, no Christian eat kosher. So why Allah he allow you to eat the, the, the food of the Christians? Go ahead. We eat halal. We eat halal. No, we eat halal, it bro. Says and let me the, tell you, it says and, in the Quran. And we eat halal ignorant. kitab. Ibn Farouk, you are ignorant. Chapter five, chapter, five, chapter five, verse five, chapter five, chapter five, verse number five, chapter five, verse number five. It says, "I made lawful for you today all the food of the people of the book." All yes. their food. All their food. What book, all their what, food. What, what what book do you follow? Chapter 5, verse number 5, the Quran what? says so. So the Quran what saying, do you follow? What, the Christian, you, what version you see, do you follow? You are trying to change Christian the topic what version because, because you? Ibn Farouk, you are... Okay, you we follow the Quran. Became, you you became follow the Torah. What do you guys you follow? You became a joke for everybody. First, you use fake you name. Know? Secondly, now you are trying to change versions? the topic. How many versions? Do you see, want a divorce? No problem. Okay, Bro? hold on. As long as you are saying how many versions we believe. So how your God, he says, I confirm, how I confirm, I confirm the Book, I want to read written. the original Bible. Do I'm you have ask, it? I'm asking you. Do you, you have the original Bible? See, you are trying to change. I want to read the original Bible. Do you have it? You are a coward. You are I'm running asking. away from the topic. I'm Arabic. asking you. I'm asking we you. We have Arabic. Do you okay. have the in original front, Bible? In the front of everybody. Did you read the original Bible? Let me read it. Did your God approve the book we have? Did your God approve it or not? I'm asking you, I'm asking you, do you have don't, the original gospel? Answer, Please tell me. Yes, yes. we have, no. we have, we have. And the proof is in the Quran. Where is it? The proof is in the Quran. Is it? In the proof is in the Quran. We have it. You can, you can download from There's the Quran. There's only one. In, in Jerusalem? We have, we have the Hebrew. There's only one. We have one? the Aramaic. We have it everywhere. Now I'm asking you, do you have the original Quran? Yes, we do. Where? The Quran is with us. What do you mean, where? Where, where, the Quran where, 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 where is the book of Muhammad? The Arabic. You have the a Arabic. Citation. You have the a Arabic. citation. You can find it everywhere. Ibn Farouk, listen, everybody is laughing at you. You have a citation of a guy, his name is Hafs, and the Muslim, they accuse him to be a thief, and he is the son of Hassan, and Hassan was a thief, and oh. I can show you right now what the reference is. Shut up. And in, even in the book, yeah. you have, even in the book in your hand, it, 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 says, it says, Ibn Farouk, listen. you're an idiot, you're a liar. Awesome you're is the, it's me. how you recite it. It's how you recite it. I want you to open the page number Stop being an idiot. It's how page you recite it. Page number eight. Don't tell me how to ask It's how you recite it. This book is according to the recitation. How you recite it. Of Hafs. The Hassan, the oh, Nujum, wow. the son of etc., the son of etc., according to, according to, according to, according to, according to, according How to. How you recite it? To There's different Osman. ways to recite so it. You have but it's a the same Arabic. of a guy, he is a thief who was exist 200 years after Muhammad. You never have a Now let's go back to the topic, you coward. It's the same Chat, Arabic. Same Arabic. Ibn Farouk, Ibn you're an idiot. I'm so thankful you're coming today. You're, you're Chat an idiot. Chat then you'll find out you're an idiot. Chat but you're a man. Go hug people. Enjoy your face, bro. You're a real man. 
after you, you, your face, Christian everybody, Prince. you are not wearing a you are wearing a you are wearing a you are wearing a you are wearing you change the topic you are a you are a bro you are a you are a bastard you are stupid you are a and I believe I believe in the book which is with you don't be a coward listen you coward son of a don't be a coward show your face you see, you know, he, 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 he wanna call me. I'm behind. He wanna call me. Don't be a coward. Don't be a coward. Don't be a coward. Those Christian, those Christian debaters that you talk shit about. At least they're men. At least they're men. You call yourself debaters. At least they're men. At least they're men. At least they're men. They show their face. Christian would. All those guys, I respect them. Those Christian, because they show their face. Not like you. Not like you, man. You hide behind the screen. Go show your face. Go. Why go, go, do it in public. Go, go, go. <laughs> so guys, go be a crusader, man. Be a real Christian crusader, bro. Don't be a little crusader. I am the one that crusader. Right I am the one crusader right now. I'm the one that kebab. So right Allah, He confirm what is with us in your stupid book. He hang mm -hmm. up the coward. He changed his name. He jumped from a topic to a topic. He thought we will not know that this is him, Ibn Farouk, the coward, the son of Muta. And he don't want to continue in the topic. This is the guy who he said he can debate me. In two minutes, we made him shish kebab. And he hung up the coward. Confirming which is with you, the Quran said. Chapter 2, verse number 41. Uthman ibn Farouk, you coward. Coward, why you hang up? Let us call him back. Listen, boy. Gotta go shop, Listen, boy. Listen, chapter, boy. Chapter two. Be a man like, chapter like two, the other Christian. Be a man like the other Christian. I gotta go shopping. Be a man. I'm with my daughter. Huh? This is more but important what, than but shopping. But I get home. Listen, I get home. Home. This is more important than shopping. And you call me to debate me. You wanna do shopping now? What? You wanna buy condoms? I can show you the hate about it. Uh, Tazilu. Coward. I wanna do shopping, right? Who is running? You want to do shopping? Panty shopping. So we heard the liar saying that when the Quran say people of the book, he mean those who don't believe that Jesus is son of God. How truthful this coward is. Did you notice how in the speed of light he jumped in from topic to topic thinking he can escape the humiliation which is coming from Christian Prince? You made a big mistake when you called me, even you used a different name, but you stupid, you idiot. This is the Quran. Keep calling the people, people of the book, and they are kuffar. And you said, and everybody heard you saying, when Allah, he said the people of the scriptures, he mean the true Christians who don't believe that Jesus is son of God. It is recorded. It is going to be the end of your career, you coward. Taqiyya boy. And we got you busted about Adam. We got you busted about Allah do not know the future. And you are the one who agreed that the, the angels were telling the truth that Adam did mischievement. It is recorded. I was going to delete this video. Now we cannot delete it. 
I want every single of you to download this video immediately after we finish and repost it immediately. The Muta boy, the Burka boy, he's hiding behind a fake name, calling me as a Bilal when he is Uthman ibn Farooq. And he hang up as a coward. Neither those who disbelieve among the people of the scriptures. Hmm. Stupid Allah, he keep calling us people of scriptures. <laughs> Chapter 2, verse 109. What the kathirun min ahl kitab The Christian and the Jews. They would like to make you not to believe. He said, those are the good Christians, the one who say, the Quran called them the people of the book. He said that. Don't text me, please. Don't text. Chapter 3, verse number 69. You see, all of this is people of the book. So when the Quran says, I made lawful for you the food of the people of the book he didn't say some of them he did not say some of the food he said we made lawful for you the the people of the book food all of it and the quran confirm our book when the guy that eat it he says we have the quran we ask him where you don't have any quran you have zero quran not to mention or forget to mention that the Quran you claim is preserved is even a goat ate it. I mean, what kind of a God? He could not even stop a goat from eating his book. And now we don't have the most important verses in the Quran, which about suckle me, suckling an adult. Have you ever heard of a religion? The God of this religion, he sent verses saying adult breast suckling 10 times the verse of stoning and the breast feeding an adult 10 times was revealed breast feeding for adult 10 times Ibn Farouk did you go to do suckling right now? is that your shopping? oh hold on Ah, now I know what shopping he is doing. He is buying porn pictures. Let us show you the hadith. The funny, this guy, he said the Christian prince is hiding. You made a you know you made a career mistake by calling me your coward. Everybody will laugh and die laughing. He went to do shopping, and now he will say to you, "This hadith is da'if, brother. It's da'if. Indeed, in paradise." There's a market in which there is no buying nor selling except images of men and women. So whenever a man desires an image, he enter it. Desire an image means to have sex with it. Playboy magazine. A Muslim man, who is the customer? Uthman ibn Farooq, doing shopping in the mall of Allah. What is the images of men and women? So, if a man he like an image of a man, he enter it and have sex with it. You know what, Uthman? You made my day, my friend. That is a disaster. Now, every single Abdul, he knew how small you are. 
You insult me, you try to bully me, Christian prince hiding behind Burqa. Abdul, don't you know that your God, Allah, he himself wearing hijab? I don't. I work from the internet. Everybody know that. I don't go in the street. Here I can do miracles. I want to go anywhere. But this is your God. He never spoke to anyone except of wearing hijab. Chapter 42, verse number 51. Your God, Allah, is a female. And this is why the black stone is in the shape of a vagina. Did you kiss it, Ibn, Uth, Ibn, Ibn Farouk? How I can know? He agree. I called him Ibn Farouk. This is his voice. What's wrong with you? Are you, are you silly? Are you stupid? We called him 1,000 times Uthman, Ibn Farouk. And he said, you know me. And he agree. He did not say this, not me. And this is his voice. And then the guy says, how you know? Silly people. Did you hear him saying, I am not Ibn Farouk? And this is his voice. Potato coward. Are you deaf? It is a priceless. I'm so glad that you called me. And now he is doing shopping. Uh, <laughs> when we ask him where Allah he said what you are saying, he said he will answer you in the dream. He asked me the question. Imagine he asked me the question. He said, okay, you answer the question, this question, because this is about your book. He escaped, he says, okay, maybe in the dream Allah will answer you. But are you saying to me, all the dreams you had in your life, Allah did not answer you about this verse? But you will answer me. They try to scream as much as they can, so they can change the topic. Suddenly the topic is, where is your book? Do you have a Bible? You know what? So we were talking about something. We jumped to something else. And then we jumped to something else. And we jumped to something else. Because each time you put them in the corner, they have to change the topic immediately. In the speed of light. And he thought we will not know his voice. Potato. Hmm. He hung up and we called him again and he said he want to do shopping. Uh huh. He want to do shopping. Anyway, I'm not going to stay longer so you guys can download the video. I'm not going to keep it long because I'm sure this potato he will try to take it down. So download the video. The Taliban, they were defeated and you are the witness. You saw how they changed topic in the speed of light. For Islam is an embarrassment. Islam is a stupidity. Islam is dumb. The guy he think because he eat kosher. What is kosher? You drink camel urine. And not only that, the Quran allow you even to eat any food made by the Christian and the Jews, which means even we cook poo, poo for you, you eat it. And not only that, the Quran allow you even to eat pork and the reference in the front of our eyes. If you are hungry, you eat it. So when a Muslim he speak about, do you have kosher food? Kosher food is coming from our book, not from your book. You don't have kosher food. Your prophet and his followers, they eat lizard. They eat insect. And you drink urine. You Muslim, you eat the meat of a camel. 
and this is forbidden for the Christians and the Jews to eat. You don't follow the people of the Jews. You claim to follow Moses. Do you see it? If you are in anger, you can eat anything is forbidden. So they can eat the book, the, the, the people of the book food with no exception. Now in the interpretation, they will say to you, oh, except, uh, but in the Quran doesn't say that. It says, Uhillu lakum. All the food of the people of the book. He did not say some. Coward. Potato. I'm going to finish here. So you guys can download the video we are so happy and now by the way he would deny that this is him just wait because it was a, it was a massacre you know it's for his voice he agree we called him by his name tens of time he did not say i'm not this person he agreed with it and it's, it's his voice you can tell i mean i was listening like well, who's this is ibn farouk this is the girly voice All right. So, uh, I want to say thank you all for being here. I hope you guys have a good time. I will give this video maybe five, six hours, and I will take it down. But maybe later we will pause, re-pause the video, or let us say we cut the first part of it, and we keep only the video of Ibn Farouk. So he can have fun, and people, Muslim will be proud about him, because he admit that his God, Allah, was wrong, and the angels were truthful. And Allah was a stupid when he said to them, if you are truthful. And Allah did not know the insane because teaching somebody names and asking someone else what is the names does not prove that you know the unseen. He could not answer any. Hey. This is why he was changing topic so fast. So thank you all for being here. May the Lord bless you all. And victory to Jesus, not to Christian Prince. All the victories we have here is a victory for our Lord. The truth will set you free. And we pray that the Muslim, they will watch and they will see how cowardly they could not debate, how cowardly they refuted themselves, how cowardly they changed topic in the speed of light. And they are the one who chose a topic when they call me. It was his choice. He's doing shopping. Potato. Coward as coward mean. Still we invite this potato. We will finish for today. Now he will go and make 10,000 videos to, to, to explain what happened. As usual. Or he will say, it's not me. This is boyfriend. You will see. You will see. Thank you all. May the Lord bless you. And I will see you soon again. Christ is Lord. I'm already here for almost four hours. Three hours and night 20 minutes. So this is enough for today. Thank you all for being here. Don't forget, please, to download the video, share it everywhere, and let everybody laugh at how the Abdul, they can refute Christianity. And the funny when I say to him, the word inshallah is a Jewish word. I don't really mean the name Allah, I mean the will of God. He did not deny. He said, we should not refuse it, we should not use it because it's a Jewish. Yes, you cannot. Because you're stupid, you just said which, which version you have, which per, per version you have. So if a word came in from the Jews, how you know it's true? Do you see how stupid they are? It was a Jew who taught Muhammad the oneness of God. He showed Muhammad that he is a kafir. He is not a Muslim. 
as he claimed, if a Muslim means to, to believe in one God. And Muhammad, after he heard the Jew, who he told him, you made equal, you commit shirk. When you say this, Muhammad, he did not say the Jew is wrong. He said, do as he said.